पेज नंबर नौ क्लास फिफ्थ क्लास फिफ्थ क्लास सब्जेक्ट इंग्लिश इन लेसन वन लेसन वन नाउ आई एम गोइंग टू एक्सप्लेन यू टेक्स्ट बुक पार्ट पेज नंबर थर्टीन पेज नंबर थर्टीन ग्रामर पार्ट नाउ द क्लास इज अबाउट ग्रामर वॉट इज द फर्स्ट लेसन ग्रामर सी नाउ फर्स्ट रीड द फॉलोइंग सेंटेंसेस he has given some sentences this story tells about the helen killer's first meeting with her teacher the lesson is about helen killer so the story tells about tells then gurinchi cheptundi helen killer gurinchi so this is a past already completed this already completed about this story tells about ante cheptundi manaki ante already manaki telisindi aa lesson gurinchi so danni em anali past tense already tells kuna dan gurinchi manamu past tense we have three types of tenses past tense present tense and next future tense so future past tense is already jarigi poyin dan gurinchi cheppedi so past tense now going on ee roju jaragaboye cheppedi ippudu jarigedi cheppedi present tense future tomorrow what is going on tells about in the future tense yesterday what we did that is we will tell in the past tense now today what is going on this is about present tense tomorrow what is going on it will tell about in the future tense so tells about helen killer so ante mane already tells in so it is up in the past tense next i succeed in making the letters correctly i succeed ante letters ni correct cheyadamlo thanu succeed ayindi ante enti this is uh, succeed succeed ante past tense already ayipoyindi already she succeed success ante enti raavali succeed ante already nen success ayipoyina it is in the past tense the story will inspire many people the story will inspire ee story valla chaala mandi blind people inspire avtaru so will inspire ante enti future lo kuda avochu so this sentence is in the future tense the second sentence tells about something to happen earlier past tense or the simple past tense so second sentence first sentence tells us present tense so sorry first sentence the story tells about e deni gurinchi cheptundi so it is in the present tense ippudu cheptundi kada story gunchi so tells is in the present tense manaki lesson gurinchi cheptundi already cheppesindi ante told ani raavali kani ikka told raaledu tells ochindi tells ante enti cheptundi present jarugutundi kabatti present tense second one succeed already she ha, she succeed she won so succeed ante enti past tense ayipoyin dar gurinchi cheptundi kabatti second sentence is in the past tense next will inspire manaki ee story valla manam inspire avtam eppudu avtam chadivin tarvata so it is in the future tense next all the sentences show the time when something is was or will uh, will be done so here are given first bit mention the tense of each underline verb in this sentence here are given some sentences in them sentences we have some underline words so in the page number 13 first bit in the grammar part mention the tenses of each underline words in this sentence here are given some sentences here some verbs are underlined you have to write the tenses of that underline verbs okay now here already you understood now here are underline words are tells succeed will inspire tells means cheptundi present succeed means already ayipoyindi past will inspire future ante manaku jarigedi future tense ee vidhanga meeru ikkada kuda ichina underline words a tenses lo unnai past tense a present tense a future tense a meeru raayali first one it was the 3rd of march 1887 3 months before it was 7 years i was 7 years old was given was means read the full sentence 3rd march in 1887 now we are in the 2020 it is the lesson is uh, the sentence is telling about when she was in the 7 years old already she completed the age of 7 years no so now was is tells about past tense first one is past it was ante appudu అప్పుడు అని చెప్తున్నారు కదా ఇక్కడ నేను సెవెన్ ఇయర్స్ ఏజ్లో ఉన్నా ఎప్పుడు మార్చ్ ఎయిటీన్ ఎయిటీ సెవెన్ సో ఆల్రెడీ షీ కంప్లీటెడ్ మార్చ్ ఎయిటీన్ ఎయిటీ సెవెన్ వెన్ షీ వాజ్ ఇన్ సెవెన్ ఇయర్స్ ఓల్డ్ షీ కంప్లీటెడ్ ద ఏజ్ ఆఫ
So completed means this is in the past tense. This is in the past tense. The first sentence is past tense. Simple past tense. Next. Second one. Mr. Rao will try his best to help your son learn Hindi well. So Mr. La Rao will try his best to help our son. So uh, son learn Hindi well. Mr. Rao. And at the end son and every So will try his best to help our son. Hindi lo wala babu ki try a uh, helping and ain't he doubts ni clarify chedam gani and, and a chase to chase a word. Mr. Rao will try what he is best. So it is in the past and simple chase a word. Mr. Rao will try to help his son. Next. Our team wins almost every match. Ma, uh, our team uh, almost every match lo, every match lo win out undi. It is in the present tense. Simple present tense. Next. I heard a strong story. Heard. Already heard. Ante vine saanu. Past tense. Jarige po indi. Simple past tense. Next, fourth one. Fifth one. I felt my teacher sweeps the sweep the fragments to one side. So I felt and then anukuntunan. So it is in the future tense. We'll be going on next one. Future tense. I felt. Next, sixth one. Everything has a name uh, and each name gives birth to a new thought. Simple present tense. This is the has present. Jargutundi. Next, uh, a bit change the following sentence from simple present to simple past. Present lo undi ante. Ippudu jaraga boi edhi. Present tense lo undi. So, thani meiru past tense lo raya ali. And jaraga boi natu, jarage sindhi anatu raya lan maata. So, first one. A cold breeze blew, uh, blows every morning. Morning, every morning manaki challani gallu vishtu unta hai. Roju jaragu tundi gada. So, it is in the present tense. You have to write that past tense. Jarage poi in dhanu gurin. So, yetla raya ali meiru. A cold breeze. Breeze blows is the past present tense. Blows past is blue. Blue every morning. Every morning. Next second one. Turn the paper, page number 14. He drinks tea every morning. Drinks and thought present tense. Already? Tage sir, past tense lo raayali. So drink past drank. He drank tea every morning. Next. Next. She sweeps her room every day. Sweeps past, uh, uh, sweeps is in the present tense. So, sweeps past is swept. Swept her room every day. Next, fourth one. Some students forget what they learn. Forget and they march poyar. Already well march poyar. And they forgot. They forgot. Some students means it is in the plural form. They forgot what they learnt. What they had learnt. Well, Chadvindani Marchipoyaru. Next fifth one. The boys slide and fall on the ice. The boys slide. 
slide slide is slide past is also slide the boys slide slid slide fell fall means padutunnaru so fell already padipoyaru kada fell fall ki present past tense fell on the ice fell fall fell next sixth one completed fifth one fifth one i didn't explain see the soldiers fight and win fight is in the present tense fight past is fought fought the soldier the soldiers fought fought is present tense fought past is fought and won win past win is a present tense win past is won so like this you have to do complete your first bit and i will give the uh, i will send the answers to you in the whatsapp group by seeing this uh, by seeing this photo you complete your textbooks next b bit change the following sentence in the uh, pa simple past to present past lo ichar ichina sentence past tense lo unnai meeru vaatini present tense kinda maarchali so past is and past and enti jarigi poyind dani gurinchi cheppadam kada so already the some the sentences are in the past tense now the uh, you have to change the sentences into present tense jarugutunnattu cheppal first one see sakshi uh, sakshi sang a song at the party sakshi ane ammayi sang a song ante enti already paadesindi party lo so adanni manam ippudu jarugutunnattu cheppali ante present lo cheppale sakshi sings a song eppudu ippudu paadutundi paadesindi ante sang a song పాడుతుంది ఇప్పుడు అంటే సింగ్స్ ఏ సాంగ్ సింగ్ సాంగ్ సాక్షి సింగ్స్ ఏ సాంగ్ ఇన్ ద పార్టీ ఇన్ ద పార్టీ నెక్స్ట్ సెకండ్ వన్ ఐ ఫర్ గాట్ హర్ నేమ్ నేను ఆమె పేరు మర్చిపోయాను అది ఫర్ గాట్ కి ప్రెసెంట్ టెన్స్ ఏంటి ఫర్ గెట్ ఐ ఫర్ గెట్ హర్ నేమ్ i forget her name like this remaining all sentences you have to change into present tense like third one see she did she hide behind the bushes tanu bushes podala venakala daakkundi so daakkuntundi ante hides she hides herself behind the bushes nidhi solved the sum correctly solved already she gave the answer so now you have to write the sentence is giving the answer how you can write nidhi works the sum uh, solve the sum correctly next i wrote a letter to lalita wrote is the past tense wrote present is write i write a letter sparrows bulled bulled is past tense present bulled is bulled bulled a beautiful nest next third bit is change the sentence into simple future tense ante rep jarugutundi future lo jaragaboyedi future tense anamata so future lo rayal the birds fly over the houses the birds fly over the houses houses pai nundi egurtunnai ante rep egurtayi ante will fly will fly the birds will fly will fly over the houses will fly ante repu egurutai adi future tense okay na the second one the waves rise high and the ship tosses tosses means munigi povadam the waves will rise will rise ante jaragale inka jarugutun jarugutadi so will rise tosses ante sink she tries tries ki future tense will try learn will learn సో ఉన్న వచ్చిన వర్బ్కి విల్ యాడ్ చేస్తూ రాస్తే ఫ్యూచర్ టెన్స్ వచ్చేస్తుంది మీకు నెక్స్ట్ ఒకాబులరీ నెక్స్ట్ క్లాస్లో మీకు ఎక్స్ప్లెయిన్ చేస్తాం